Okay, so let's create this uh, shark fin effect that I like to call it in uh, Blender. And uh, let's just uh, jump into it. Okay, so let's just go AX and delete. We're gonna go into top view by clicking seven. I'm gonna go shift A and we're gonna use a curve circle. We're going to scale it up seven times and now we can go shift a again and just bring in our empty and i like to use the cube so i'm just going to go with that i'm going to scale it down and now we're going to attach this empty to this curve circle so we can move over to the constraints open up the constraint tab here and click follow path and then just use this eyedropper tool and click on the Bessier circle like that and now we have this option here to move this empty around this circle with this offset so next step here is to bring in a UV sphere so go mesh UV sphere you can scale it in and then just move it down on the Y like that and um, here we want to attach this UV sphere to this empty and to do that, we can hold down shift, click on the empty, and then go control and P and set the parent to the object. So now if we go back into top view, open up the timeline, we can use this offset to create this uh, looping animation. So we're just gonna click on the side of this offset here and create a keyframe on the first frame. And then we can double up our frame number to 500. And we want to go to the last frame and one frame more. And we're gonna set this offset to 200. So that is two rounds around this circle. And just uh, click this keyframe symbol here. And now if I play this animation, we're gonna have this UV sphere looping around like this for two rounds so let's just reset it and uh, click on the empty and right click on the timeline so just hover your mouse over the timeline and go to interpolation mode and set this to linear so now this animation will move with an even speed as well okay so then the next thing here is we're going to bring in a surface plane so i'm going to go shift a plane we can scale it up eight times like that and go into top view and let's go into edit mode and i'm just going to right click and subdivide open up this window here and we can set the subdivisions to 80 and we also want to subdivide it a couple more times just make it really dense like this and uh, the next part here is that we want to attach we want to bridge this uh, UV sphere with this uh, plane here. So we're going to create a connection with using some physics. So click on the UV sphere and then go over to the physics, click on the dynamic paint and change this to brush and then just click add brush like that. Then we're going to click on the plane and dynamic paint and we're gonna use canvas, so just click add canvas. We're gonna change the surface type from paint to displace. And we can check this box for the solve, open this up. And we're gonna set the time to 180. And we also going to bring up the max displace all the way and the, the displace factor just bring it all the way down like that so now if I play it we have a cool looking fin that goes in a circle like this obviously this is like really what do you call it um, a rigid or innovation hockey geometry so anyways we want to smooth it up so let's just smooth everything so it looks better and cleaner so we can just click on the plane and we can bring in our 
uh, generate go here and go to subdivision surface and we can use two and now this is going to move with way less speed so let's just do this in a little different way we're gonna um, add modifier and we're gonna go deform and we're gonna set this to smooth corrective and we're gonna use 8 here and now it's moving way faster and it's way more smooth and if you want this to be completely smooth you can bring in a subdivision surface on top of this but that will also make your computer run way uh, slower so this is the way you can go and create a shark fin in blender uh, or shark effect fin something like that um, from here you can just bring in a water material and you will have the same animation that you saw earlier and um, have a great day and, uh, and no 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 uh, just wait uh, and wait five minutes five minutes yeah okay thank you gracias okay so i was um, interrupted to <laughs> today as well that's fine uh, have a great day and uh, peace out